Hello guys, welcome back to another video today. Today is Premier League prediction time again. This time going into New Year's Day. So Happy New Year to you. I hope you have a good one. And let's get into it. So the first game obviously on the agenda is Brighton versus Bournemouth. My local team. Um, South Coast Derby. I think Brighton might just edge it. Um, I think we're close at Newcastle. We had a couple of good headers, but won't to be. But for the reason that I've seen, uh, Bournemouth had a deflection, I believe, in the game just gone. I'm going for a Brighton home win on that one. The next one is Burnley versus Liverpool at Burnley. Um, For this one I'm going a Liverpool away win, no disrespect to Burnley but Liverpool are far at the minute, everything they touch is turning into goals, um, so that's why I'm going a Liverpool win. The next game is Stoke Newcastle, um, now for this one I'll go a draw. Um, Newcastle didn't really look that dangerous on the attack that I've seen from the Brighton game they had the odd opportunity yes but I think Stoke managed to hold them out same as we did so for that I'll go a draw Everton Man United at Grinison Park mm, tough one Rain really plays his old team same as Lukaku I know the car crew's out due to that injury. Sorry, I forgot about that. Well, anyway, Rudy's going up against his old team. Uh, Man United are oh, the car crew. With the car crew out, I might just tip it off for an Everton win. Um, purely because they've got no the car crew. I'm not saying Marcus Rashford could score, he can, but I'm just going to tip it off for an Everton home win. Next game is Southampton Crystal Palace. Um, now, if you watch my vlogs, you obviously know Crystal Palace are Brighton rival. They're saying getting in the way. For that, I'll tip it. They draw 0 0 against City. Um, so, for that, I'll go. I'll tip it off just for a Southampton win. Just so. I do believe that Palace can hold them out. I do believe Palace can beat Southampton. But due to what we're going through at the minute, I think Southampton will just beat them. Or maybe just get a draw out of it. The next game is Swansea Spurs at the Liberty Stadium. Now, I'm going to go obviously with a Spurs win. Now that's no disrespect to Swansea, but I went up to Wembley and Tottenham do look good on form. If you're not going to get, get into the game, I'll show you up. Um, so for that, I go a Swansea, uh, sorry, a Spurs away win. The next one is West Ham West Brom. Um, now I'll go West Ham home win. They've not played, didn't think they played this week, I think that's their next game, is in the new year. Whatever reason why, I don't know, maybe put it down in the comments below, if you're a West Ham fan and you know why. Um, so for that reason, I'm going on a West Ham home win. The next one is Man City Watford. Now Man City at the Etihad. Um, what do I say about that? Uh, obviously, just drew 0 0 with Palace, which I said. But no disrespect to Watford. Um, I'm going to tip it off for Man City home win. 
the next one is a big one it is Arsenal Chelsea um, now Arsenal Chelsea um, I think that's going to be a tough uh, game for both sides um, so for that I'm going to tip it off as a draw a likely draw or if I'm going for the winning side, I might just tip off Chelsea. Now, Tottenham play again on the f fourth. So, this is why I get mentioned twice in this video. Due to all the midweek games going on, this is why. Um, now, I'll top it off for a Tottenham home win. Uh, no disrespect to West Ham, they're coming back into form, but I don't think you're going to manage to hold Tottenham. Sorry, West Ham fans. Alright, guys, that's the end of today's prediction. If you're new to my channel, subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.